What's up, y'all? Welcome to my channel. I am Carrie Monet, and today I'm going to tell you everything that you need to know about yarn locks. Okay, just to give you a little backstory, I've been wearing yarn locks for a little minute now. I've had red locks, black locks, black locks with blonde locks, and now I have blonde locks. Okay, okay. So I know a little thing. I know a little bit, a little something about yarn locks. So I'm just going to let you know everything that I know so I can help you. Just in case you plan on getting some yarn locks now or in the future, tomorrow, next week, whatever. <clears throat> okay. So first things first. Yarn locks are literally the cheapest route to getting locks. Like if you want full locks, yarn locks will literally be the cheapest way to get them, to achieve, you know, locks or whatever. I got my lock, I got my yarn from Walmart and it's like $3 a bundle or $2 a bundle depending on the size you get. I used a jumbo size and I used a regular size and it was perfectly fine. It was enough. I even have a little bit left over. But anyways, you need to know that when you do these, you need to have like a day, you know, where you're not doing nothing. You could just sit down and do your hair. Or if you're getting it done by someone, just, um, I don't know how fast or slow they might do it, but if you do them yourself, they might take a little time. They always take me a little time when I do them myself because I always take breaks and everything like that. But just remember, it's going to take some time. And also, the second thing you need to know is that you need to make sure your hair is super duper moisturized when your hair is in this style. Just like your hair needs to be moisturized before you put it in any style. So that's a given. They are going to be tight. They are going to be tight and they're going to be... um kind of stiff when you first do them they're going to be kind of stiff because i don't know it, it, does that happen for every type of locks i don't know but when i do my yarn locks they be stiff for like two days but when they loosen up honey it's worth it this this style is so beautiful like i love it i definitely recommend yarn locks over any other type of locks because it's cheaper and it's just i don't know it just looks better to me personally wait okay so basically um Basically, I just want to just break down the pros and cons about yarn locks just to give, you know, quick overview. Okay, so pros about yarn locks are they're affordable. They're cheap, actually. And I feel like they last longer. And um, they're lightweight. Yarn is lightweight. It's yarn. So it's not going to be heavy. Unless you do like a million dreads in your head, then I don't know what to tell you. But if you do a decent amount, then it's not going to be heavy, okay? It's easy to sleep with depending on the size and the length, okay? Because that definitely plays a factor into how heavy your hair is going to be, okay? Another pro is that it's also a great protective style. So, you're not going to have to worry about, you know, doing your hair. So, that's a pro. Um, yarn locks only have one con, and that con is that, like I said in the beginning, it's just going to be tight when you first do them, and they're going to be stiff. That's the only con, that I could think of. Um, it's not itchy or anything like that. Oh, make sure you get the right type of yarn too because if you get the wrong type of yarn, it's going to lock into your hair and you're going to be really mad when you when you take them out. Okay. So yeah, <clears throat> I think that was everything I wanted to share about yarn locks to help you if you decide to get yarn locks. Um, definitely give them a try. I definitely recommend them. They, um, they're really cool. Like I like them. I love them actually. So yeah, hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. 